hog swim on the long lake. Again, another swim where you feel like you've almost got a little lake all to yourself. No one can really interfere with you here. You've got your own best part of an acre to play with here. Now, you've, you've got the obvious features. You've got some margin bushes over there, some willows, so you know the fish are going to be cruising along that margin. And then you go right down into the, the corner of the bay here. And it, this is the end of the lake, the end of the long lake. And when the fish get down here in numbers, people have come in here and absolutely whacked them. But again, you go round to the swim to my left, my right now that I've turned round, you go again, got more very nice looking margins. So you know that you've got all of that area of margins to fish to. But out in open water, towards that corner, the big poplars at the back there, there is a bit of a sunken plateau stroke island. And there's a, a bar that runs off it. Now I'm not talking about a savage bar like you're fishing in the Colne Valley where the bars are savage. We're talking about a subtle feature as it, as it runs down up the lake. And that feature can produce a lot of fish because again, the fish are using it as a roadway. So get your marker rod out, have a little plumb around. But a lovely swim this, again, I mean, you just feel like you're lost in your own little world in a lot of these swims. And this is another one of those swims where you can sit down here, a little bit of peace and quiet and lose yourself. And if you're lucky, get amongst the real whackers.